Hello again everyone. Uh, today andito tayo sa greenhouse and I'm going to harvest some of our spinach leaves kasi magluluto ako. So, I'm gonna show you. I think I'm gonna use this one to cut the leaves. I'm cutting the leaves para ma-encourage siya to encourage this kasi meron na siyang mga it's already got some little ones here so if we cut it we're gonna encourage hopefully to grow some more branches so ayan and more that's it so I will leave this few leaves on the top and the ones in the bottom so, ito naman guys ang kukunin natin. Ayan. And another one. Oops. And we get this one. So, so ayan. These two, meron silang dahon na natira sa iba pa. Pero, as you can see, meron na siyang, there's already a little shoot over there. So, it's gonna be fine. And this one naman, kunin natin yung, ano, kasi pag, oh, hold on. Kasi pag din natin siya kukunin, yung dahon niya is lalaki masyado. Tapos masasayang lang din naman. So, harvest na natin yung mga malalaki. And we, also, we will also harvest the one inside the house. And here naman guys, we have pak choy. This is the second batch of our pak choy, guys, that I planted. So, ito, malaki-laki na siya. So, I'm gonna get one. Ayan. The rest, medyo maliit pa sila. So, ayan, guys, yung mga natira natin. Dan. At yung string beans natin, guys, look at that. They're getting big. Ayan, behind it as well. If you can see behind on the foil. Yeah, so they're not very ready yet, but they're getting there. Mm. So, ito harvest na lang din natin ito, kasi nag start na siya magflower. But if you can remember, guys, this one, I leave this one to flower so I can collect the seeds for next year. That's the purpose of that one. And the same goes on that one over there on the back. Para yan sa, for the seeds. So, tingnan nyo yung ating ano guys, mga pepper. Um, I don't know if it's a gonna be a bell pepper or a cayenne pepper. But yes, I can see the flowers already. And I hope they will make it. You know, I hope they will make it. The, the fruits will make it. And yung okra natin, the flowers over there, they're already bloom, some of the flowers. But the ones on the bottom, guys, I didn't notice the flowers bloom. Ano lang siya, para lang siyang dumiretso lang siya. So, I hope, I hope they will be okay. So far, it does look good. But yeah, we'll see. Let's go outside the greenhouse. Right. And dito naman yung tomato natin, guys. Yung red cherry, no, not red, um, sun gold cherry tomatoes. So, last night, umulan, and this morning when I came here in the garden, these cherry tomatoes already lying down on the ground. So, I don't know what happened. I didn't realize it was that windy. So, ayan, I put it leaning on that side so hindi siya matutumba. So, kukuha tayo ng tomato. Few, only few. Ayan guys, oh. Ayan, di ba? Ang, ang ganda ng tomatoes. Kukuha lang tayo ng few. Dalawa. Tatlo. Ayan. 
So we're going to add our lemon grass and more over there. So kukuha tayo dyan kasi mas malago siya. Let's see. See if you, if I didn't show you before this one guys. Meron din tayong uh, total of 3 tomatoes on this area. Next sa ating greenhouse. I don't know, hindi ko na nabilang ilan dahat ang ating tomato plants but yes. I think so far I only have probably three varieties of tomato this year and two varieties of the tomatoes are f grown from seeds the seeds that we saved from last year and one of them which is the sun gold tomato yellow sun gold we bought that from the shop guys and then I got Yes, so we have probably two varieties of tomato I grow from seeds from last year. And then I got this one which I bought from the shop. And then I, I got cuttings like this one, soaked it in water. And I think I have a total of two tomatoes from this. From this plant so overall I got three like this one so yeah this one I'm gonna just throw it away because I got so many plants already I don't want any more tomatoes because I've got far too many and yes it's costly uh, buying compost so that's it for now and don't see look guys on a glalaro sa tubig and it's been raining this morning look at our bananas guys ang mahal pa naman pala nito sa ano sa mga shops pero dumami sila guys o tingnan nyo ang dami ng shoots so winter time we just wrapped it with cloth parang shelter niya and they're okay they grow back yeah so i guess that's it see you later at ako ay magluluto muna ng lunch ko so ayan guys ito lahat yung na-harvest natin sa ating greenhouse and oh by the way guys i'll show you some i'll show you that one guys that is my taro we call that one gabi in Philippines. I don't know if you call that the same in your province or country. But I think it's taro in some countries. And I love this one. I love using taro for my soup like um um any soup, pork, beef, mga sinikang and all that. But I don't cook sinikang that much, guys. But this one, I really love that one. And it's growing. I bought that from the shop. And then I let one of them grow. So, ayan na siya. Uh, I think I could have used a bigger pot for that one. Pero, it's okay. Beautiful, isn't it? Anyway, guys. That's it for now. And, our ginger pala, guys. So, our ginger over there is growing. Uh, as you can see, I got lots of lemongrass, one over there, and there's more over here, and all the way down here, and then more in the bottom. But on the bottom, I got uh, ginger again, which I just got from the shop, and planted the, the roots, you know, the, I don't know what they call it, the tuber. And this one as well is ginger. And I got another one somewhere. Oh, anyway, that's it, guys. See you later. Oh, ito pala, guys. Oh, ayan yung isa yung maliit. Maliit yan. So, that's it. At ito naman yung spinach natin na nasa conservatory natin, guys. So, I also harvest the leaves kasi it's getting long and lumalaking masyado yung mga dahon. 
at para magano siya magsanga-sanga siya ba so i mute this video kasi mainga yung tubig um anyways ayan pati yung malunggay natin guys na harvest ko lahat yung malunggay natin may isa lang ako na malunggay na namis na hindi ko na harvest pero the rest ginawa ko yung mga dahon most ng mga dahon mostly ng mga dahon nila para they will grow uh, another you know mga sanga pa branch Hopefully, if they don't die. Oh, I hope not. And yes, I'm planning to buy them a grow light. I still have to research on that one because I don't have any clue which one and how to choose. Because uh, I notice every time I plant malungai, they don't survive after winter. I don't know if it's because of the the cold here inside I even put them inside the house but yes hindi talaga sila nagsu survive so I don't know kung ano ang reason so yes keep watching for that update if ever so yes that's it kami ni Luke today nito and finish na siya guys wala kasi kami ginawa today wala nang school and it's weekend at na prepare ko na yung ingredient niya few days ago kaso di ko nagawa kasi walang egg so ayan ginawa namin today 